Hey guys, Mushroom Gecko here, and I want to show you guys what I've done with the mini game Hyper Powers. Now I created this entire thing from scratch. I loaded up a brand new world, and I just built off a single block. And uh, yeah, so here's what I'm kind of doing. I uh, I added in a shop. Uh, I've, n I've not done the fun house yet. I'm still doing the redstone on that. But we do have a. Uh, but I added a timed match that uh, allows you to turn time timing on and off. I have a start game button, and I have different types of arenas, such as the end arena, the nether arena, and the water arena. So um. Those I've not finished yet either, but all these game modes I have finished, such as multiplayer mode, which is no mobs, easy mode, medium mode, hard mode, and hybrid mode. I'm not going to spoil too much, but uh, if you guys have already played this, you guys know some of the classes. I actually added uh, two more down here, Halo Miner and Igor. Uh, I'll put a link to them below. Uh, Halo Miner 316 is the YouTuber. Um, and yeah, and Igor is just one of my friends. He loves Enderman, and I'll leave a link to his channel also. He actually has two channels. Um, so yeah, we have some rules over here, and you guys are going to probably be mind-blown and kind of be like, what did you do, Mushroom Gecko? Because even on the side, I'm a little technical with the, uh, the game points and all that. But let's turn up my video settings real quick. This, th th hang on, that's not even all. Like, this is just, this is just the end arena. And I haven't even created the templates for them yet. Um, hang on. F3A, reload the chunks. So, uh, yeah. This is what I've done. I've destroyed Minecraft. No, I'm not. Um, anyways, um, so what I've done is I'll point to the things that I shall show you guys. I do not know why these are here. I do not know what they are. Uh, okay, I guess. Don't know what this is. Don't know why there are separate command blocks like this but okay oh because i was doing like some sort of title thingy i think yeah i was doing some sort of title thing but that wouldn't work so let's get rid of these so um i just wanted to show you guys a little sneak peek of hyper uh, powers and uh about what it's like it kind of let me i'll give you a little brief explanation on it it is um what it is is kind of like you guys probably know of the game Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat is like a street fighting game. Like at the end, you have like this special move that like destroys your enemy. But this you can do right in the middle of the battle, where like if you get a certain amount of kills, you can like release your hyper power and just destroy everything. But I can't go through every single piece of redstone, but I'll give you a little brief explanation of something like this area right here it is to release some hyper powers of some characters um and this is to test for potion effects see if someone has um no no it just hang on it's to test for a certain amount of kills someone has and it's going to give them a potion and in this area right here test for the first command block test for the potion and then just activate the power here, right here, we have the uh, the classes that, um, and I have the new title command, which I'll show you guys in a second, going on in this little here thingy, and uh, right here, we have a clock that if you press it, it tests for a score, and then it starts summoning zombies in an arena, but I'm going to add more mobs, obviously, because that's how awesome I am, into the water arena, the nether arena, and the end arena, right here, we have, like, the easy, um, uh, I'm kind of confused myself in a way. Oh, yeah. Over here, we have hybrid mode, hard mode, medium mode, and easy mode. 
and then no mode, uh, no no mobs. We don't need something for that because they, they these right here will not read if they have the score or not. So and right here just activates a few more hyper powers. But this right here ends the game if you like drink a certain potion and um, and this thing right here, this clock changes the scoreboard so if like it goes to there to total kills next one hyper point right here we have total death and uh yeah we have time zombie kills game points yeah so i i you guys probably want to see the arenas this is just the old ragtag arena the end arena which um i'm gonna add upon so uh yeah it's not completely done yet over here uh, is the water arena, which I do not want to get in a fight with. So, um, oh no, this is the nether arena, I, I apologize. This is going to be the nether arena, which I also have not designed yet. And this one over here is the water arena. I definitely know that for a fact. And I actually have been starting to work on this one. Just that I'm creating a little bit of parkour. Like, I'm just making some obsidian stuff over here. And it's just going to be a whole bunch of parkour. And this one's going to probably be the most annoying because I'm going to have skeletons in here shooting at you. So, uh, yeah, skeletons plus water equals uh, failure. Big failure. So, yeah. Um, just wanted to give you guys a little sneak peek on that. Um, although, I did want to show you guys like the shop and the and how I use the title commands in this so um so yeah let me get into here and uh slash glitchy slash game mode 2 and then slash clear even though the game already clears you if you like choose class oh yeah and I forgot it automatically gives you a saturation for the entire game, so you like never run out of hunger. And we have regeneration, so that when the game ends and someone tries to punch you in here, you automatically regenerate. But in the game, it automatically takes that away. So yeah, if uh, these right here, like I said before, do not have um, you can press them, it does nothing. But if we pressed, uh, but if we press a class, a unicorn swag. It would bring up a title, Unicorn Swag, to tell you what class you are. So if I did, like, slash uh, scoreboard, uh, uh, players, set, or set, set, Mushroom Gecko, uh, Hyper Points, 10. Uh, it, it will give me the Potion of Swiftness, and if, you, and if I drink it, it will automatically get rid of the bottle, and it will say the person that used it, that drank the potion, and what the special move is. So, I'm Unicorn Swag, and I drank the potion, and I got the Swagalicious Blade, and as you saw, it just disappeared, because I have a time on that, which takes it away after some time. So, um, so yeah, nothing, like, overpowered or anything. Now, for this, you can, like, choose that, and it says, like, no mobs, uh, easy mode, medium mode. Um, so yeah, let's just go with that, and, like, these, nothing yet, and, um, for the shop, it says shop, obviously, um, and over here we have automatic trophies, um, that, that you get for achievements, so they're, like, achievements, like, executioner, kill one, uh, kill 100 players, the last survivor, kill 1,000 zombies, murderer, kill 5,000 things, Sacrifice, die 1,000 times, and uh, Hyper Destroyer, kill 10,000 things. So if we go back to spawn here, we have spawn, and, uh, yeah. So we, so, oh yeah, over at the shop for the trophies, I constantly have a clock going. At test 4, if you have a certain thing. So, uh, like, let's say if I do scoreboard list, if I will delete fast enough. List. Yep. Sorry. Scoreboard. Object. Oops. Ob ah. Objectives list. It is a. Uh, 
it will show all of the objective zombie kill game mode game point total kills hyper uses hyper points uh, hyper uses I should delete because I do not know how to operate that to be an achievement deaths time player kill total deaths and arena now the arena scores is going to test for what arena you choose the total deaths is going to test for like the trophy player kills trophy time it's uh, going to test for if at a certain amount of time it can end the game it, uh, at deaths it's going to test for a certain amount of deaths for a player that it put them in spectator mode hyper points um I, I just all gives you your hyper power. That's like the most you uh, that, that that the thing that that I use most on here. Hyper uses, like I said, don't use total kills, trophy, game points. Um, it just tells you how many kills you got that game. So like it's not like it different from hyper points. Hyper points gives you a power or a game point tells you your score for that round. Game mode, it is the easy, normal, hard, and all that. Zombie kills, which I'm going to change to uh, mob kills. Uh, test for what you kill. You know, I'm going to probably do like zombie kills. Um, now you guys probably expect like um hmm. Actually, I'm going to get rid of the zombies, and instead of doing zombies, I would do skeletons, so instead of zombie kills, it would be skeleton killed, and I have two more objectives that I'm going to make, called endermite kills, and, um, and wither skeleton kills. Now, the endermite, because endermen are not automatically aggro, whereas endermites are, so I'm going to spawn them double as fast as the zombies, and if for the wither skeleton, you can probably guess where that is. Whereas the, uh, where the, ske where the regular skeleton are in the water arena. Because, you know, I, I like to be annoying like that. So, like, if I uh, press spectator real quick, it uh, it actually puts everyone back in the center. If it, like, it tests for absolutely everyone spectator mode. And if everyone is in spectator mode, it teleports everyone back in the center and, tele and uh, makes them... Um, Game mode 2. So, like, let's go to Mushroom Gecko real quick. And I have MG's job, Mushroom Gecko. Uh, and we are going to... Just, just, just for the lols, we're just going to go easy mode. Start game. Oh, wait, it's not working because I didn't set the objectives. So, um, hang on. Slash scoreboard. Players set Mushroom Gecko. Uh... I mean, arena, death time, total death, arena one. Okay, here we go. Now, it gave me two potions. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, like we have a zombie spawning because we selected easy mode. Now, if we selected medium mode, it would do iron armored zombies. And if we drink one of these potions, the potion of strength. It teleports us back in the center, and it says round ended. So that's basically all I want to show you for now, guys. Just just a skeleton of the whole uh, of the whole game, and I will get back at you with uh, more updates for hyperpowers. You can download the alpha version on Planet Minecraft now, where it does not have any of these features because these features are still a bit buggy, and some of them I did not write yet. And um, so yeah, I'll put a link to that in the description below as well. So, uh, live a wonderful life from the mycelium mushroom. Have a good time, Club Geckos, and keep those gems shining. Everyone, get go out. Boop. And see you.